At Becky Boyer's home, <coughs> the newest addition to the family is settling right in. <laughs> She loves lettuce and dislikes apples. <laughs> Polly Pocket was one of 49 guinea pigs surrendered to St. Paul Animal Control on Wednesday. By Saturday, all were gone to rescues and foster homes. Cage, hay, food, water bottle, everything. Everything was set. Um, we just needed to bring her home. From Becky and Egan to Mike and Rosemont. Our foster group leader, she was contacted my wife and, and we said absolutely. Minnesotans stepped up. My wife and I have been doing it for 17 years now, and usually dogs, but uh, you know, we have a foster turtle. And now, cupcake. It's wonderful how many people, you know, really step up and, and help out when there's animals in need. Both Becky and Mike think that their guinea pigs are pregnant, and with an average of three pups in a litter, experts say it's easy for their population to get out of control. The situation could have been so much worse. The last thing we want to do is shame someone that did come forward and was seeking that help and they did the right thing. Rough Start Rescue was one of several organizations that picked up the guinea pigs. We just want to make sure people know that rescues, animal controls are a safe place <laughs> to reach out to um, and they're not going to be criticized for asking for help. They still have several waiting for their forever homes while others may have already found theirs. Do you think you'll keep her? Uh, probably. <laughs> In Egan, Kirsten Mitchell, WCCO 4 News.